Folks, hello and welcome to Tavern Chat. I am your host, Eric Tenkar, your bartender in the OSR. And today is literally last minute prep for North Texas RPG Con. Now, I find prepping for a convention that you fly to is a little bit different than when you're driving to it. If you're driving to a convention, even if you're staying overnights, um, you don't have to worry about how much you pack, right? You pack as much as you want. Whatever you need, it is what it is. You've got a trunk. When you're flying, I don't like uh, dealing with checked in baggage myself. I know. What can I tell you? So, it means I have one carry on luggage and one carry on bag. So, what do you do? What are the first things when you're prepping? Well, if you're somebody who takes medication, especially prescription medication, stuff that you are not going to be able to replace. Uh, I'm going to have to tell you, pack that the night before. Now, what if you have to take it at night? You got to take it in the morning. If it's, a, if it's a substantial amount of medications, prep it, have it ready for the night before, for the morning of, pack those medications prior. Now, why am I saying pack them prior? Quite simply because the one thing that if, if you're somebody who's on prescription medications for any kind of chronic illness, that's the stuff you can't replace. Can you replace, I don't know, Advil, Tylenol, um, allergy meds, decongestants, something that, oh, if your, your tummy is off, you, did you bring your Tums, all, all that stuff. You can pick up at a Walmart or you can pick up at a Dwayne Reed. You can't pick up your uh, Entresto, Jardians, Violenta, Metformin, whatever you, whatever it is that you are taking, okay, this is stuff that needs to be done. You gotta, and you have to be in, you've got to be in compliance with medications, right? That's the whole thing about staying healthy. What else is important when you're packing for these trips? Your electronic doomajiggies, all the wires, all the cables, all your chargers, uh, if possible, pack them the night before. Nothing sucks more than you go to a convention and you don't have the charger for your laptop. All right? Nothing sucks like, oh, I didn't bring the right but. The charger for a laptop is the most crucial if you bring a laptop with you. Some people don't. I do. I do live streams. I, I put up uh, daily blog posts. I need I need the laptop. So what do you do if you, if you forget? Well, maybe you'd be lucky. Maybe somebody at the con has a compatible charger. You may be lucky. I, I wouldn't bet on it. Pack the night before electronics charge up your iPad your tablet charge up your phone a lot of us could check in with our phone right boarding pass you swipe you're in well if your phone's dead you're going to shut out a lock charge it up I like to use I have a, I had a number of uh, these little chargers, these were actually not that bad. I think I got them for like $19.99. They charge up my iPhone three or four times. I've given away a number of these. Actually, I think I gave away one at last. North Texas to somebody who needed a charger. I gave it away. I gave one away to my son's uh, fiance the other week. They are very handy, something like that, good size. You want something that will charge your phone three or four times. Why? Well, you know what? We like to think that, yes, you'll charge your phone overnight. Maybe you don't. So your phone can charge while it's sitting in your knapsack or your bag when you're sitting at the game. Important stuff. Here, we're going to go a little bit more esoteric, and some people are going to go, huh? Bring some clothes that you don't really care if it comes back. You know, yeah, yeah. The story's like, oh, you, my, when you were younger, always wear clean underwear, don't have any holes in your socks because 
What if you got to go to the hospital? You don't want to bring... If you have socks that have reached the end of their life, those are the ones to bring to the con. Why? Because you throw them out the last day. If you have clothing that you don't care about, it doesn't look horrible, all right, uh, the shirt's getting too big. I'm going to have to donate it. Uh, leave it at the con. Less to go back with you. Less to go back with you, especially when you're flying, means more than you can, you can pick up. If you happen to be um, a diabetic, I happen to be type 2, I'm no longer on insulin, but if you are somebody who's a, a diabetic, make sure your insulin is ready to go. Now, that has to be cooled, potentially. Um, what else with that stuff? I, in my case, I got my my patch. I can remember to do it in the morning. It's got to get changed on a Wednesday morning. So I'm going to do it tonight before I go to sleep. I'm going to have two weeks. I'm fine. I'm dandy. Try to get things done the night before. Because I'm going to guarantee you the, the morning of, you're going to go, oh, shit, I forgot X. I forgot Y. Certain things you can forget. If you forget to bring enough underwear, enough socks, um, if you forget to bring enough shirts, or any, you can go to a Walmart. There's a Walmart pretty much everywhere. Go to a convention, befriend somebody, let them drive you to a Walmart. It'd be amazing. You go to one or two conventions, you start making friends, you start making acquaintances, you'll get invited to go for a drive, to go get lunch or dinner. Use these opportunities to cover for what you might have missed, toothbrush. A lot of times your toothbrush, a lot of times the hotel will supply a toothbrush and toothpaste for you. You got to ask at the desk. Some don't, some do. Hit or miss. But if you forget, and, and everybody forgets at some point, don't go around not having it. Don't forget to, par to uh, pack your deodorant or antiperspirant whenever you wear. A brush or a comb. And I'm sure you can buy it at the hotel. But these are those little things that we tend to forget. They're the incidentals. Incidentals are always going to get you in the end. And that's why they're incidental. But remember, core stuff, medications, electronics, especially chargers, spare battery. Uh, in my case, I got the uh, spare camera for my computer. Because we want to be able to turn stuff around easier on the uh, whiskey tasting. So these are all little things. Just tidbits. Put them in the, your head. File them away. They apply to most trips, but it's con season. So I was taking con. Folks, I know you're going to be very upset to hear this, but the next five days are probably going to be live streams from North Texas. Actually, you're not going to be upset. You're going to be happy to hear that. I, I'm looking forward to... Here's the thing. I'll be off my laptop. My ability to interact with you may be limited on the live streams. Don't be offended if we don't get to you. Just something to keep file away. On that note, we are still in the midst of the world of COVID. Please take precautions that are appropriate to you. Your situation, your risk factors, your location. Be safe, be well, God bless. Roll those dice, roll them well. And I will be back again tomorrow. Live stream from North Texas. Looking forward to seeing you all. Or being seen. Some shit like that. I'm looking forward to seeing my friends at North Texas. All right.